Alright, hey, welcome back to the channel. In this video, we are going to continue our Dark Dimension 7 series. Uh, when we're finally at the global section, obviously we've abandoned our No Apocalypse uh, run. Seeing that is no longer necessary because the Apocalypse requirements are so easy now. Um, but uh, I have had a lot of requests to show Cabal in Dark Dimension 7 um, and to see how they perform. Now, I've heard all sorts of things with this team. Um, ranging from great to absolute dog uh, dog crap um, this is the strength of my team i do not have like nine diamonds on cabal i do have three diamond on namor but aside from that uh, quicksilver is the only other one with diamonds the rest of them aren't even at seven stars um, again i've heard the full spectrum with this team and i think a lot of it, it largely depends on your star levels your diamond levels and also how you play the the, the node so um, I've heard people get stuck and had to request to get uh, had to request to get the, uh, the nodes reset that's on node 2 because uh, there's like a there's like a wave where void knight does uh, incredible damage against you so but anyways point is there's all sorts of different experiences with this team <laughs> so just keep that in mind and so you you Playing the node as well as possible does make a difference. I guess let's just say that. Um, I'm going to go ahead and do this and hopefully I can get rid of Iron Patriot. Iron Patriot is a mess. Now this this initial, this node kind of sucks because um, it's a bit of a mess due to the fact that Magneto clumps you up at the beginning and it's, it, it sucks. But you only have to deal, it, deal with it for the first wave. Um, okay, let's see here. Is this unavoidable? Yeah, it doesn't. It is unavoidable. Is he, uh... Okay, good. Let's see what happens here. Boom. Okay, we ability block that dude. Don't need to worry about him anymore. Okay, so now we got, uh... Scarlet Witch on the board. Boom. Now... Hmm. You... Especially with this team... The, the Cabal's biggest weakness is their long cooldowns and especially because they're slow that makes it even worse it compounds the issue with their cooldowns so you always want to make sure you're in a good position so i'm going to go ahead and burn this okay now um now the other thing i want to try and do my best to remember is that i do not want to use leader's ultimate unless making sure nobody's dead because then I can get three ability energy to the Cabal allies. And that's key, right? Because their cooldowns are so long. Um, but let's go ahead and use this. Boom. Okay, great. Um, I kind of feel like I want to do this. And well, let's, let's extend that ability block on leader. Okay, great. Not liking where, uh, see this, I'm trying to, I need to get to that Kang. Um, I'm going to try and not use that yet. I'm not going to, well, I am going to use it. Try and get uh, some, something on that Kang. Try and get through that taunt. Great, they're both toast. Um, cannot be dodged. Okay, hopefully we can get rid of this dude. He's too far. I don't even know where this positioning is. Let's try this over here. Hopefully, I want to get rid of this Kang too. Okay, great. Let's go ahead and use it. Boom. Oh, that Kang is almost toast. Now, great. Look at this. This is what I wanted. Now, all my members are alive. I'm going to give them each three energy. So that's great. That's, this is probably the most important thing to remember. It makes their cooldowns that much more bearable. We got rid of Kang finally. I'm actually shocked that Leer is still around. Um, I'm really liking this hit. We got rid of Leer, great. But we need to be mindful here, right? This wave is uh, Iron Patriot's toast. Now we need to be mindful of our cooldowns here. Let's see if we can try and get some survivability. Now I don't want... Hey! Why didn't we get... Uh, Oh, does it not give ability energy to himself? 
I thought it uh, to all Cabal allies. Maybe it's not to himself. Huh, that sucks. Well, <laughs> well. All right, well, there goes that idea. But at least uh, Namor and Iron Patriot got their energy. That's kind of cheap. All right, so cool. So the decent hits all together. Uh, look at that. Uh-oh. Ouch. All right, not bad, actually. Okay, not too bad so far. Hopefully we can get to... Uh... That Sylvie's done some serious damage on me. She's going to pay for that, but... Uh... But again, Omega Red still probably the more... Oh, come on. <laughs> come on now. Okay, great. That sucks, but uh, we got uh, Omega Red, or uh, we did pretty well. He uses ultimate, great. Um, I'm gonna save this. Well, actually I got an ultimate coming up, so I'm gonna go ahead and use this on Sylvie and hit this group here. Boom, that should take care of what's her face. They, Sylvie uses her ultimate. All right, great. I'm actually pretty satisfied with that hit. Um, we took out 14 enemies. All right, so we're we're gonna go ahead and do this. Uh, we're gonna burn some cores and take a couple of hits per day on this. Hate to use it, but uh, we got plenty of cores. We'll be all right. All right, so let's go in for our second hit. Now this is what I'm talking about: is our cooldown management. I don't recall. I may be saying that my my cooldowns gonna be total garbage at this moment. But again, using the opportunities like this, right? I mean, we're, we're in a decent spot. Where, what wave am I on? Um, Sylvie, Taskmaster. Okay, so the next wave drops with less than three enemies. Ah, <laughs> so so the next... Uh, I'm gonna make sure Iron Patriot doesn't... Do, so the next enemy that dies is gonna bring the next... Or, or next two enemies that die. There goes one. Okay, so that wasn't very good. So we don't want to burn anything here. Let's just try and get some cooldowns back. Uh, not bad, not bad at all. So we're still going to try and milk this as much as possible. Mm. Uh, everyone's going to die. Boom, there's that. And then might as well just get rid of uh, Sylvie here. I probably could have milked that a little bit more. But all our cooldowns I think are ready. Now we got Dorm here. This guy's great. Um, okay, cool. Boom. I wish we could get rid of the revive once as well. Let's work on this dorm. Ba -da. Boom. Um, let's see. Should I burn it? I think I may save it. Let's just do the basic. We still get the assist, that's great. Uh, cannot... Uh, let's do this on leader. Just like before. Let's extend it. Great. Hmm. I wonder if I should stun Kang. Yeah, let's stun Kang. Great. And then let's get rid of. Uh, can this be dodged? It can be. Uh, let's get rid of Kang. Boom! He's toast. Oh, he had that revive once. I'm sorry. <laughs> what am I? I just I just gave it to him. I just gave it to him to just mutilate me. Okay, great. Totally forgot about the revive once. Oof. Oh, there goes uh, Black Knight. Let's do that over again. I don't like that. I think I should have left. I should have left Kang alone, and then I should have uh, controlled uh, Rogue. Oh, but uh, I think this is also the cheater uh, Archangel that ults every turn. So let's get let's focus on that dude. All right. So I want to do this a little bit better as well. Not that I can really help that, but. Uh, 
I want to try and milk all my cooldowns so my cooldowns are ready. Okay. Not that big a deal. Okay. Boom. Okay. Get rid of Sylvie's toast. Taskmaster is toast. And Iron Patriot. There's no way I can, nothing else I can really do with that. Um, I'm going to try and give uh, Quicksilver a little bit more protection here. I guess I will go ahead and use this. Bop, 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 bop. Great. Everyone has defense down. Um, the speed bar rewind rogue. And then let's target dorm while we do the ultimate boom. Oh, look at that. That's beautiful. Um, I thought I had one where if they get killed, they cannot be revived. That's, that's Black Knight's old, isn't it? Uh, well, whatever. Let's just get rid of all these uh, revived ones for some of them. So there's Rogue gets one of them. There's Zombie Juggernaut for one of them. Dorm is Toast. Um, let's go ahead and do this so we don't get stuck behind her. Boom. Let's go ahead and Ability Block Leader. And Stun King. I think that worked out. <laughs> and I'm gonna leave him, I'm gonna leave him be. No, don't kill him. Okay, great, let's extend it. Fantastic, we got rid of Rogue, that's great. Um, let's work on this Archangel. Before he deletes out uh, somebody. Great. All right, we're doing all right. I'm liking this. Of course, the, of course, Global Node One is not the hard one. Global Node One is fairly, fairly simple. It's Node Two that's where, where things get get a little nasty. Okay, there goes Scarlet Witch. It's toast. Um. I do not want to do Kang any favors. I can't even target this other dude over here. <laughs> Come on, oh, there we go. Um, he's still ability blocked, right? Yeah, he is for two turns. Uh, too many zombie juggernauts. Um, well, let's just go with the basic. I don't want to. I don't want to undo that uh, that stun on Kang until he burn. At least he, I take advantage of the fact that he's gonna lose a turn. Okay, great. And then hopefully, if I have a you no know, one more turn, and then I can delete him without having to even worry about him. Oof, that's horrible. That was brutal right there. Um. Well, that's gonna do it, Jason. So hopefully that doesn't. Hopefully that does not kill Kang, because Kang is stunned for two turns. Okay, great. Oh, there goes uh, Quicksilver. Oof. So we can get back to. Well, it doesn't matter. It doesn't really matter. Um. There we go. It doesn't really matter because uh, once they come back, their revive once will be gone anyway. So, all right, that's going to be it for this one. Uh, two hits uh, for today. Not bad at all. Um, kind of halfway through the node, so not too bad at all. So first hit 115, second hit 133. So, all right, uh, hang in there with me. Uh, I was expecting it to be a grind, not too bad so far, but node two is really going to be the test. So, all right, that's it for this one. Please like and subscribe, join the content, and I'll see you on the next one. Thanks.